Also, I would uh, like to know, you have mentioned about this non-invasive treatment, and I've been uh, uh, privileged to attend your lecture on this health economics. I want to ask you, what would be the relevance of this non-invasive treatment in an Indian scenario? Because you know, India is a very large country where almost 20 million people has cardiovascular disease. So how would this non-invasive treatment can be positioned as a cost-effective modality for the patients? If one does the math or run the algorithms of cost compared to value proposition that you offer to a certain group of population is that a non-invasive therapy, if it provides that symptomatic relief, it provides symptomatic relief to a very large population in India, I think the eventual burden on the exchequer of India and the government of India will decline. And that is where I think ECP has a significant role. So ECP is doing two things. It is providing relief to patients, but it is also giving an impact and reducing the economic burden on India for healthcare. So it is a twin approach that you are serving society. So because those resources that are spent heavily on healthcare, that will decline and can be used much more for maybe rural development and other purposes because you are addressing a healthcare need, applying principles of economicity. Yes. Fine. I mean, uh, 